looks like a darn ghost town on my street. Look at the fog. Jeez, not to mention it's deathly quiet. Wow. What we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Y'all, I am so tired of working on Sundays. I, don't, I have no words for how tired I am. Sundays are literally the longest day of my week. And I don't know if it's because it's the end of my week or what, but I don't like it. I don't like it not one bit. And then I got to come home and I got to do homework for work. Who feels like that? giving a day to the Lord and she gonna say well I'm 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 watching the celebrity all-star game so you just gonna put the Lord on pause so you can watch a basketball game I don't have nothing to do with it that's all her that's all her Lord mm -mm. so after church I know what we're watching today what we missed the Clark Sisters movie last night. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Which does it come on? Lifetime. I saw um, Mel talk about it. I was like, wait, what? And I hit the hashtag and yep, and came on yesterday. It's a movie? Yeah. Not a series? Mm -hmm. <laughs> we Man. waited so long oh, for that damn and movie and, and forgot about it. I blame the Rona. It's got us out. It's just taking us out. You know? What are we focused on? Drinking. Yeah. Which we need to re-up. Badly. It looks funny. Like, you can't even tell what that is. <laughs> that it is, is a crab omelet. Well, crab egg. Crab yeah. fried egg. I didn't, I didn't turn it over. I just said it on top. It's the lump crab meat. And, of course. Gotta have the bacon. Gotta have the bacon. Alright y'all. It's been a while. We haven't been on YouTube in a minute. But we are quarantined like everybody else. And sorry y'all, I'm cooking. We are quarantined like everybody else. And so we've been Netflix and chilling. And in the midst of Netflix and chilling, we are watching this damn Love at First Sight show. I'm just saying it, y'all. I'm just saying it. I don't like Jessica. Jessica, not for me. I don't like the way she's dead, Mark. We haven't gotten to the end yet. And I'm sure later on in this video, we will have gotten to the end and you'll hear our thoughts about that. But I'm not feeling her. I feel like Mark can do way better. And he's wasting his time. He need to go ahead and get him a good little 24, 25, 26 year old, 30 even, you know, cause he seems a little mature for his age. And uh, leave that old bitch alone. Like, and I'm not here to age shame. 34 is not old. Yeah, I know my wife is 34. She'll be 35 this year. It's not about her being 34, but she's just acting like an old bitch. Like tell that man you are not physically attracted to him. You struck out over Barnett, whether it's because he's a white frat boy or what, or, I don't know, but let let Mark go so he can go ahead and find him a good woman. Just let him go, sis. Let him go. In the meantime, I'm cooking dinner. Leah, y'all know she's essential personnel, so she's still working. She's getting ready for work, and I'm cooking dinner. We just have a little shrimp starter, fried with garlic sauce. I make my own sauce, no store bought sauces here, guys, and it's so freaking good, so good. All right, making dinner. I am making 
frying fish tonight and a little fried shrimp and some kind of vegetable. This quarantine has been destroying our diet. I'm usually done cooking by this time. It's almost eight o'clock and I'm just about to start frying fish. I ain't even put the grease on yet, y'all. It's bad. But it's been, it's been a very drunk, but safe and healthy quarantine. Hope you guys are keeping it together. I've been home for about a month now and yep. A month, a month home. My last day at work was March 13th and it is April 8th. So yeah, it's been cool though. We've been chilling, we've been TikToking. I hope you guys are following us on TikTok. Love Life and Labels, same name across the board for everything. So yeah, let's just. All right, getting ready to make dinner, fry fish and a meal tonight. It was late though, but you know, quarantine life. Chef Boy Lee. Yes, because when you get your letters, you gotta make sure you don't have any ground pieces in there. Now, I'm real particular. See, the letters down here got brown on there. I don't like that. It turns me off, you know? Yeah, I don't, you know, I don't know. All right, now, thoroughly wash your letters. Thoroughly, okay? Don't just hit it here and then take it there. No, you gotta wash them thoroughly. All right? I guess the oven's ready. Yep, yeah, it's ready. What I like to do, I like to get inside as best as you can. You see all of that still dry in there. You don't want any contamination going in your body. Turn the water back on, of course. Rinse them all. Rinse them all. Don't listen to people. Come out, they don't wash their produce, okay? They be dying. They be dead out here. Now, see how the edges are brown? We don't want to eat that. That ain't it. That's not it. So let's just waste half the lettuce leaf. Yeah, well, you know. Get rid of all of that. You don't want none of that. You don't want parts of that. No. Make sure that you drain it as best as you can. I don't like wet lettuce. Yeah, we need a salad spinner. We really do. Every time we go out, we forget to get we one. We do. I can't stand wet lettuce. Goodness gracious. They gonna be wet tonight. <laughs> That's what she said. That's what she <laughs> That's what she said. And all that hand washing and all that she talked about went into this. <laughs> I mean, with everything that we've been drinking during the quarantine, we're trying really hard to eat vegetables. Uh, <laughs> and not come out of this looking like beach whales. Yep. So, yeah, salad for dinner. <coughs> but we also got leftover steak from last night. Yeah. So, you know, balance. I mean, that's it. Life is all about you know? balance. <laughs> Somebody eats good. That's p.m., guys. 9.28 p.m. This is what I'm up doing. <laughs> 